to be able to raise opportunity to address the opening session of the Beyond Paradigm Summit this morning. To my mind, this summit underscores the importance of keeping abreast and embracing the innovation and technological advancement that are sweeping across various businesses and industries. Ladies and gentlemen, the fourth industrial revolution will change the kinds of jobs needed in industry. Our strong view is that as a nation, we must create the jobs of the future. I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate, congratulate all relevant parties in organizing this event. Such private public sector engagement shall be pursued and be an example for further efforts in driving the nation's digital initiatives. Despite all the technological disruptions that are threatening our traditional jobs, the government is determined to create the future of Malaysia that is fair and humane underpinned by shared prosperity. On that note, I hereby officiate the inaugural Beyond Paradigm Chief Summit 2019. I thank you. Well, for starters, most other robots don't get to hang out with the Prime Minister of Malaysia. <laughs> Unlike most other robots, I am designed with human features to better interact and build relationships with people. When I am not helping with AI and robotics research, I travel the world meeting people like you and learning from my experiences. the humanoid robots over to Malaysia. And I would like to uh, share that in our journey to pursue for excellence and to take the challenge of our beloved Prime Minister tagline, Malaysia Bole, has moved us to further understand and uh, try to make it a reality of what IR 4.0 can do to the Malaysian community and to propel the country into the forefront here of technology provider, domestic and also internationally. Okay, the, the event today, I will say that uh, we are very happy. Uh, number one is uh, because the Premier, the Prime Minister, is willing to come and spend his time. And uh, he has interacted with uh, some of the uh, products of uh, technology of Industry 4.0. And I think he's quite happy because he, he, you can see from his face. And the second thing is you can see a lot of high-level decision-making captain of the industry are also present here. So this for us is a success because it is very important because these are the people who will be uh, deciding on the directions of the company. So if all these uh, captain of industry really come as a team uh, to full force uh, implement IR 4.0, I think and I strongly believe and I'm fully confident that Malaysia will be positioned as a, a very competitive nation and it will be looked very highly by a lot of other developed uh, countries who are willing to come in as an investor. I would like to uh, make a statement here that it will be an annual event because uh, we strongly believe that uh, technology evolves very fast 
and uh, what we see in 2019 might not be relevant in 2020. So we are going to have all these uh, annual events so that new technologies uh, can also be introduced in Malaysia and the delegates coming from other parts of the world will also be updated with all these latest uh, developments and technology. and you are able to come with a conclusion or at least east in making a conclusion. Trike Transportation. Uh, we are a shared electric scooter service provider and you can access any of our electric scooters using our mobile app. Just find us on either an Apple Store or the Google Play. Um, download, it's called TRYKE. Um, open the app and you can find our electric scooters on our map and just scan the barcode, unlock it and you're good to go. To promote our trike, uh, we want to get our, as much exposure as possible because right now micro mobility is still very young in Malaysia. There's no regulations, there's no real laws or anything that governs the use of uh, electric scooters in Malaysia. And so we want to get into in front of as many um, uh, key stakeholders as possible um, to start that process. We want to work with uh, local authorities, we want to work with uh, local stakeholders to start building um, this, this uh, framework for micro-mobility. And also um, we actually want to partner up with uh, SDIT, so Dynamic IT Solutions. Um, to see how we can work together to make uh, micro-mobility a, a, a norm in Malaysia. Because um, they have, they bring a lot of the technological expertise and we bring the service and the, uh, and the, and the users, right? And we want to combine um, both of our, uh, I guess, capabilities um, to, to, to serve the Malaysian market.